All right, guys, today we are back at the Party Place in North Canton, Ohio. I filmed here a couple of months ago, just when they just began putting out some Halloween stuff, but now they have it all out, including the Halloween flags and the enormous inflatable pumpkin. When I drive down this road and I see this enormous inflatable pumpkin, I know it's on. Okay, let's make our way in here. I cannot wait to see what kind of awesome Halloween goodness they have in store at the party place this year. Oh my gosh, they have some good looking hay bales up here. Look at this. These are even better than the ones I got at Lowe's. How much are these? Let's see. Straw bales, $11 each. They have corn stalks over here too, in which I was actually looking for. And they have tons of pumpkins here. God, I love pumpkins. I show you these every year, guys, but they have these awesome things out here. This one's a witch and a black cat on a broom. And you get behind it and you stick your face through there and have a picture taken. They also have this one down here with Frankenstein and a jack-o'-lantern. I just love the way they decorate this place at Halloween. Look, we have the giant costumes painted on the windows up here. We have the giant pumpkin that they build around the doors. And they have the awesome black and orange flags around the whole perimeter. Look at that. So awesome. Okay, let's go on in and see what we have. Look at this. Stepping right in the door, we have this fellow. His sign says, enter if you dare. Look at that, I love that so much. Ooh, and if we push the button, his eyes flash. He's kind of like a skella mummy. Oh my gosh, yes. Look at this, guys. They have an enormous inflatable pumpkin up here right as we enter in the door. This is what I'm talking about, guys. This is why I love this store so much. Look at all this awesomeness. And there's even more on this side. Okay, let's just start right here. First, we have the ghost face inflatable, which is this the one that I actually own? I think I actually own this one. He is awesome. Then we have this one right here, which is a spooky looking jack-o'-lantern with three friendly ghosts popping out the top. Oh, look at this. We have an awesome selection of Halloween balloons here. If you want balloons for your Halloween party, check these out. These are awesome. These are like those Mylar balloons, I think they're called. Oh, that's a happy birthday one. But look at this. We got a pumpkin guy up here. We got Jack Skellington. We have this one with a spooky ghost, bats, and a jack-o'-lantern. And who is this animated inflatable right here? Here. I don't think I've ever seen this one before. Ghouly chick. I think it's a chick. <laughs> and she's actually spinning left to right. She's pretty dang tall, too. She's got to be about 10 feet tall, I would think. And right at her waist, yeah, she just spins back and forth. Or twists, I guess. She doesn't actually spin. That is pretty cool. I don't think I've ever seen that one before. Oh my gosh, I can't tell you how much I love that giant inflatable pumpkin up there. That is so cool. I hope they have those for sale. All right, we're going to come back to this stuff in just a minute, but let's go over here because I see another awesome huge inflatable over here. Holy crap, look at this thing. Oh my gosh, it's an archway. I thought it was just a big skull on top of the thing there, but it's actually an archway a skeleton archway this thing is huge and i love how it's purple instead of black look at this look at the teeth i love the teeth they almost look like marshmallows oh my gosh this is gonna be bad i already want to buy everything i see dear wife i'm sorry i spent all our money on halloween so anyway where are those inflatables oh my gosh guys look at this they actually have the morbid clown carousel. I know some people who would kill for that thing. And they have two of them. Look at this. I don't even know where to start in here. There is so much awesomeness. We got hanging ghoulies up there and down here. We got this shaking inflatable guy up here. A small inflatable ghost right there. This awesome multicolored spooky ghosts inflatable. I love that thing. This spooky guy here. This spooky spider right here. Hello, sir. We have some of these giant seven foot titan skeletons and they have just about any size of skeletons in here you could possibly want. Try me. Okay. Oh. <laughs> I love the sounds he makes. 
He, I've got my eye on you, he said. Oh my gosh, yeah, they have these skeletons here. They have life-size skeletons down here. They have smaller ones down here. They have bags of skulls up here. And even these skelly guys up here. What is this one? This is an older one here. What? This is made by Forum Props. Ooh, from 2016. I guess he's not an animatronic, he's just a prop that stands there and looks spooky. Ooh, they have some posable pumpkin kings here. Look at this flying dragon. He's purple, that is sweet. More hanging skele ghouls over here. Ugh, look at that disgusting hair, I wanna puke. So this must be the bride and groom. And then look back here, we have a skele mummy back here. I love this one. Oh my gosh, look at the face on that thing. Little hanging skele guys here in white and black. Oh, they have a try me button. The eyes light up, yes. There we go, we got both of them going now. Very cool. We got this hanging scarecrow clowny guy. I like how his hands are just made of straw. And you gotta love the skeleton gorilla. What in the world? It's a skele bear. Oh my gosh, look at this thing. It is literally a skele bear, a skeleton teddy bear. I, I, I can't walk out of here without buying this. I love you, skele bear. <laughs> that is the coolest thing I've ever seen in my life. Look, his name is Teddy Bones. Oh my gosh, I've never seen anything like this in any other Halloween store. Oh my gosh, guys, I am so glad I came in here today. I almost passed it up to go to another store. Look at this. They have a donkey skeleton. You cut me deep, Shrek. You cut me real deep just now. And an alligator skeleton. <laughs> oh my gosh, they have dogs and gargoyles. Is this a mini? Ta oh my gosh, I think this is a cat, actually. Kitty? Kitty bones is what that's called. That is hilarious. It's almost like a mini teddy bear. We got monkey bones here and rat bones. And look at these. This is like a vampire, I guess. Vampire bones and Frankenstein bones. Guys, this is the best selection of bones I've ever seen. <laughs> oh, this is cool. Light up large skull. Here's another different one up here that just lights up on the inside and flashes. Ooh, yes, look at this. Flashing pumpkin, it's like a blow mold here. That is awesome. Little pumpkin skele guys here, floating spiders. These are all big furry spiders like these. We saw these guys in the last video. They're not working right now, but they just like grunt and growl and move around. And then we have these pumpkin guys right here. Yes, how cool is that? He's like a groundbreaker, grunting and grueling. Grueling? Maybe it's growling. <laughs> and I believe this one on the top is like a pop-up. Let's see if we can get one of them to work. No, they're not working, but I believe... Oh, there he goes. <laughs> Just when I least expected it, he ripped his head off. It's like a pop-up pumpkin here. He is pretty cool. Let's watch that one more time. Yes, very cool. I love it. Oh my gosh, guys, there's just so much I am like overwhelmed with all this stuff. Right over here are two of the inflatables I was just talking about. This giant seven and a half foot pumpkin that we saw when we walked in the door, he's $159.99. And then the multicolored spooky ghosts down there, they were $149.99. Oh, look at this, we got Pennywise, we got Freddy, five foot collapsible coffins, the Gothic Collection Halloween decoration. This is a Oh. <laughs> he's not very loud, but he's got his own stand that he's standing on here. Talking skeleton, we got this skele guy here. We got this pumpkin patch jack guy right here. Look at this. Ghost face scarecrow. Holy crap. Guys, I, I am blown away with the awesome stuff that they have here right now. This is $49.99, and it is a ghost face scarecrow. What the heck, five feet tall. I love this so much. Oh my gosh, that is just so unbelievably awesome right there. All right, let's go over here, guys. We've been through most of this section and we will come back to get the rest, but I wanna find some more of these inflatables and stuff. Look at this one here. It's a giant inflatable archway with spooky ghosts around it. Those are so cool. <laughs> oh my gosh, you gotta love ghosts. And what in the world is this thing? It has a try me button. 
Um, okay, it's not doing anything, but it's some kind of ghoul. And then I couldn't help but notice the Slender Man back here. Yes, look at this guy. He is super creepy. Oh my gosh. All right, let's keep moving here and see what else we got. We got this standing animated witch right here who is standing right here. Let's see if... Okay, yeah, what the... Oh, okay, she's trying, but her batteries must be low. I think all of these have batteries in them, but look at this. We have some more stand-ups here. We have Michael Myers and Jason, and there is actually a Friday the 13th this month in October. Holy crap, guys, it's in a couple days. What in the world. If there's one thing you can expect from this store, it's for them to have things that you cannot find anywhere else. Look at this, guys. I, I cannot believe they have the Cellar Dweller. Look at this. That is an amazing find right there. And they have two of them. Look at this. They're only 25 bucks a piece. What the heck? That is an awesome animatronic right there. And look at this one right here. Straight from the grave the Grim Reaper. So this one is not an animatronic, it's just a six and a half foot tall posable lawn decoration, but look how cool that looks. Oh my gosh, and this one also is only 25 bucks. Those are both made by Fitco. Then look at this. Look at this awesome Freddy Krueger headstone. Look at the face on that thing. Freddy Krueger, may you rot in heck. <laughs> we have this one over here that I haven't seen before, the Crypt Windows. Look at this. What? Is this an animatronic? I don't think so. Are, what in the heck? Maybe you get all three of them, or maybe just... Okay, you just get one, because that one's x -ed. It's a ghoul in a crypt window. Oh my gosh, there's so much cool stuff right behind me, guys. We're going to look at all this in just a second. But I can't ignore the skeleton band back here. I know I've showed you this before, guys, but look at this. This is so cool. I love how they have, like, the party lights going in here. I wish they had some spooky music playing. But we got the singer, we got the guitar player, the bass player. Back here, the guy on the, uh, the keyboard. Or that's like a marimba. Oh my gosh, he's playing the bones. Look at that, he's playing bones with bones. And then over here we have the guy playing the drums with bones. Oh my gosh, this is like a giant haunted house in here. I just turned around from the band and this guy scared the living crap out of me. <laughs> Here's another older animatronic by Morbid, the straight jacket clown. So I just stopped to watch a video about this guy. I wanted to see what he does because by the picture, it looks like he thrashes around. But online, the videos I could see, he just basically stands here and kind of moves real slow around, which is still kind of cool. Look at this, I love this cemetery gate up here. They always have these two ghoulies in this store at Halloween. They totally creep me out. They have a giant skeleton back here. I think he's probably 10 feet, because I have the 12 foot skeleton, and I think my 12 foot skeleton is even taller than him. But we also have these here that I've never seen. These like Skella mummies. And apparently they are, are they animatronic? Let's see, we got a button here. It says try me, so I'm gonna try it. Oh. Oh my gosh, he is so awesome. All right, let's move on from here, guys. I wanna go back over and look at these inflatables here because they have so many cool ones, starting with this ghost face that we saw at the front of the store, $69.99. I know I have one that's very similar to this um, that I got at Spirit. I think it was $99.99 there. Of course, I had the 20% off coupon, but this one's six feet tall. He's pretty cool. What is this? Ghost with blue lights, self-inflates quickly, indoor-outdoor use. I like the face on that guy. Oh, he's the one that we saw inflated way up here by the pumpkin. And then here's the one with the three ghosts that we saw when we first walked in the door. Then we have this giant 11-foot spider crawler archway. Look at that. That is sweet. That's a giant butt on that spider. <laughs> here's... Oh my gosh, I'm a nerd. Here's the Pumpkin King archway. I love that. Oh, that's actually up there inflated. We're going to see that in a minute. Let's see. Here's the skeleton archway that we saw when we walked in, and I said I was going to buy it, but it's $249. Man, I don't know if I can get myself to spend that kind of money, even though that thing is totally sweet. Here's that other shaking ghoul that we saw up on top of the... Uh, 
whatever you call it down there. <laughs> and here is a Pennywise inflatable. We saw Pennywise inflatable somewhere yesterday. I think it was Menards or something. And it's a little bit different than this one. This one is from the original movie, and I think the one at Menards was from the new one. Here's the ghosty archway right here. That's nine feet tall. We got the spooky guys here, another ghosty, and here's female phantom is what that's called 10 feet tall and she's the one that we saw up front that turns from side to side oh and i can't forget about the ghostbusters stay puffed eight foot tall ghostbusters stay puffed all right guys we're gonna make our way up here and see that line of animatronics and inflatables in there in a second but i want to look at these because look at this corny thing here giant bat look at the face on that thing <laughs> oh look at this we have an animated severed hand here is there a button where's the button there's a tr okay that's a try me button but the battery must be dead wait a minute maybe i can turn it on hold on now on yeah battery must be dead on that that looks pretty cool though looks like a, a severed witch hand we have a box o heads here what the heck this looks like the dummy slappy from Goosebumps. Look, this one only has one eye. Giant climbing spider that you attach to your house. We got this guy, I think we saw him already. What the heck? This looks like the thing from Toy Story. <laughs> it's a baby's head on a spider body. Spooky skull coffin cover. We got light up doll head garlands. Oh my gosh, how much creeper can this stuff get? Look at this little guy. I think he's some kind of a sidestepper. Is there a button? somewhere it looks like he wants to do some sidestepping but i don't see any buttons anywhere oh yeah i think we looked at this in the last video the ghost face grave breaker how cool is that we got cocooned corpses spider cocoon victim here we have these other grave breakers six foot reaper with staff and we have spooky gnomes on the top here look at the face on that guy i'm pretty sure we looked at all this in the last video because i remember the bago skeleton and the bago skulls here whoa what in the heck is this alien tree peeker look at this you put him around a tree and it looks like he's peeking from around the tree i love this so much right now whoa wait a minute do we have something else here that's gonna move and scare us is there a oh yeah <laughs> what in the world i think she's saying something but i can't tell It sounds like she's crying and saying something like, save me. We got a little cardboard cutout of Chucky here, and look at these little pumpkins. These remind me of the Nightmare Before Christmas. Look at that, so Tim Burton. We got all kinds of headstones over here. These are all made of foam. Oh, heck no, we got the hanging demon right there. That looks kind of like the hex spawn. Okay, we're making our way down here, but look at this. I love these spooky witch cauldrons. And I found a new love for them this morning because I was watching a video by Wicked Makers where they redid one of these and they made it actually look like a witch's cauldron. And they put like bubbles and lights and fog inside and hung it from a tripod. It was so very cool. And look at this. They have the giant ones. They have smaller ones up there every size of cauldron you could possibly want oh my gosh guys this is all party supplies here and these are so cool like these little party favors we went through most of these in a video that i did last year here look at these little pumpkins i love the face on those and here's some that don't have pumpkins they're like squishy you could draw your own face on over the sharpie and look at this i don't think i've seen these in here before these little squishy plush guys that's cool that's like a witch right there oh look at the ghost look at the face on that ghost and what is this one right here oh oh my gosh look at this okay it's a bug it's like a pill bug out here and then you can flip this around and it becomes another bug like a spooky green bug oh my gosh all right i wish i had more time that i could actually go through each and everything here but if you go back and you watch that video from last year you will see that most of this stuff is in that video except for this skeleton bone back scratcher that works pretty dang good thank you mr skeleton yeah and on the other side here as well this is all party favorite 
savers too and most of this is in that old video of mine from last year oh my gosh there's just so much cool stuff in here i get so excited but i'm ready to go up here that looks like the catacomb creature right there let's go check these out right now look at this lineup guys how cool is this all right let's just go down here and start with this giant inflatable pumpkin archway because i have never seen this thing before and it is so cool i've seen regular ones that just have a few pumpkins but this is like a double stack of pumpkins and it looks like each and every one of these pumpkins has its own individual face i love that huge one up there and look at all these coming down the other side so very cool then we have this trio of ghosties right here hello if i'm not mistaken i believe the faces and the rib cages light up there is a button here but they must not be plugged in right now because they're not turning on okay it is time to check these guys out first we have michael My whoa michael myers this might actually be the same one from Lowe's that I bought last year. I don't think so, though. I don't think you could see his eyes as well in that one. I'm thinking he just had black eyes, but it is the same music. I'll have to get that one out when I get home and find out. So we got that guy. Then we have this guy here, like a grave watcher. Ooh, and we got step pads. Okay. Do you see those shadows dancing just out of my lantern's light? Don't you worry, those are just a few of my friends eager to get this party started. Every year we all come out for some fun, and it's always a night to remember. <laughs> <laughs> I knew he was going to laugh at the end. That is cool. He's got to be about eight feet tall. Michael, I think, is about six feet tall. I don't know what this lady's name is, but she also has a step pad here. Oh, oh my gosh. That thing is creepy. Your life must not be very important to you coming here this way. <laughs> no matter. You will have an eternity to mourn the mistakes you have made. Now that you're here, you can never leave. That thing is creepy too. Oh my gosh. And she just keeps going and going and going. I just wish that they like had him in the box or the name set out here because I don't know what she's called or this guy right here, but they are both awesome. If you guys know, let me know in the comments. Okay, yeah, this is definitely the catacomb creature right here, but we got to look at this witch first. Look at this. Oh my gosh. This is one of my favorites ever. I love the animatronics where they're holding a little kid and a kid is like thrashing around and screaming. Let's hope that's what's happening right here. <laughs> yes. <laughs> that, that, that is one seriously creepy looking witch too. Look at that face. Oh my gosh, let's do that one more time. All right, here we go. Look at this. Oh my gosh. I love that she was actually talking this time instead of just laughing. That is absolutely hilarious. Oh my gosh, that is definitely my favorite in the entire lineup. That is so cool. If you know what she's actually called, let me know. I would love to buy her one day, but I think the only one they have is this setup right here. All right, let's move on to the catacomb creature. This guy is awesome. Okay, come on, please. Yes, here we go. You shall know me for the billowing cloud of plague in my wake. For I am pestilence incarnate. Approach and seal your doom. I love how he's so loud, too. All right, let's move on to this witchy woman here. Come on, witchy woman, here we go. Do you not hear ugly witches? Perhaps you should <laughs> Ooh, I love that she lunges. I did not expect that at all. 
Did you see how the eyes like went cross and in different directions? Look at that. to play a game of tag. If I catch you, I get to turn you into a toad. Abracadabra! Oh, She reminds me of Heckles with her face all kind of smashed up like that. Oh my gosh, guys, look at this one. It's a scarecrow, but I hadn't looked closely at him yet. He has a talking pumpkin plant. At least I assume it's going to be talking because it looks like it has a jaw. Look at the teeth on that thing. All right, I am dying to see what this guy does. I am so happy with how my carnivorous crops have bloomed this year. <laughs> Look at this fine specimen, ready to chew the hand off an unsuspecting visitor. My trick <laughs> pays treat. <laughs> Yes, so as he talks, the pumpkin plant snarls. All right, let's do that again. Some pumpkins are meant to be eaten, but my little carnivorous pumpkin has turned the tables on you, humans. <laughs> don't worry, he only eats flesh when it is rich. I don't suggest you point at him, or you might not get your finger back. <laughs> This guy is so cool, guys. I cannot believe I never saw this animatronic before. That pumpkin plant absolutely cracks me up. If you guys know what this is, let me know, because this is another one I definitely got to buy someday. All right, that's all of these guys, and then it brings us to this Enormo Skella guy right here. I believe I have seen him before. He's like a giant reaper. I think he's... I don't think he's 12 feet tall. I think he's 10 feet tall, but I'm not sure. Let's go ahead and hit the button here and see what he does. <laughs> Welcome to the afterlife. <laughs> Beware all ye who enter here. <laughs> Come on. Go ahead and live a little. It is later than you think. I will be coming for you soon enough. <laughs> he is so awesome. I love his deep, booming, scary voice. Okay, so there's the whole lineup up here, guys. These are so awesome. I could not even pick a favorite if I had to. Although, I, I guess I'd have to say it's the witch with the child. Because that one is just too hilarious to me. But they all were totally awesome. And I do love this scarecrow with the talking pumpkin plant. That is so cool. Oh my gosh, guys. I have had so much fun in here. Look at this. We even have a stack of Jack Skellington inflatables here. And let's not forget about these guys. In no way, shape, or form did I see everything that there is to see in this store, guys. Look at all this stuff. We're just gonna take a quick walk down here and you can just kind of watch and gander at the things that we see as I walk by. Cause I have been in here for literally two hours at least looking at this stuff and just having so much fun. I love these jack-o'-lantern lanterns so much. There's three of them in there for $10. I wanna get a whole bunch of these and hang them from my trees out front. They absolutely have every single thing you could possibly need for an awesome Halloween party in here. And I mean, everything guys napkins paper plates they got cups fake blood things to stick on your walls backdrops oh my gosh just everything look at this popcorn and treat bowls over here look at these cups right here with pumpkin faces those are so awesome and not to mention the entire upstairs is nothing but masks and costumes and i mean the entire upstairs guys this is the downstairs where we just were looking at all that stuff and this is the upstairs nothing but costumes and masks two-man horse they have gorillas and chicken suits what in the world is that <laughs> i will come back a little bit later on look at this thing mouth opening action what the heck that is the creepiest thing i've ever seen in my life hello trick-or-treaters but like I was saying, if I have time 
before Halloween is over, guys. I will get back here, and then we'll go through all these aisles and look at all these costumes for you. I could just stand up here all day and just peer down over all this Halloween goodness. Jason Voorhees life-size cardboard stand up and even better freddy versus jason oh my gosh that is the coolest thing ever all right we're gonna finish it off walking through here because i said that we hadn't seen everything through this area i just want to take a quick look and see if there's anything else that's worth mentioning but yeah i think we pretty much saw everything else over here between this video and the last one that i made um, just a lot of stuff over here like fog machines, fog juice, light up pumpkins, happy Halloween signs, um, pumpkin lights right here, which I love. I think these are so cool. And yes, the entire time we've been here, I've been thinking about this guy, trying to convince myself to and not to buy him. <laughs> <laughs> 